Moldova, I believe, has still a lot to do to create conditions to reach the goals of social and economic progress. I have to tell you very frankly that I was quite disappointed when I heard about some important cases of corruption and also uh, instability in our country. I know how much Moldovan people are expecting this progress in their country. That's why we believe these reforms need to be supported, need to be done and supported. When you look at the most successful countries in the world, including the European Union, some more than others, those have achieved the highest levels of economic development and social well-being, basically what we know about that. Besides being open economies, open internally and open externally, market economies, besides that openness, there are basically three conditions for success. Education, high level of education, infrastructure for the country, from transport to energy to technology in general and digital economy today, and rule of law. That's why I always start by the rule of law. Because without the rule of law, there is not the necessary confidence for investors. 